at the part where we're going to install the two-piece shower drain assembly. There's a proper way to do this and if you don't get the order um, of the rings properly set um, you'll have leaks and you don't want to have leaks especially after you um, screw this all down and tile the whole shower. And normally we'll test it and make sure there's leaks before any of that goes. But So this is how it goes. Now this is a two-piece. Um, we'll be gluing PVC into the base of this. Some have a rubber gasket in there where you can adjust the pipe. We're not going with that. We have plenty of room underneath the house to be able to install the drain pipe. So what you're going to what this is going to require is you're going to need some plumber's putty and you're going to take plumber's putty this is Odi stain free plumber's putty so we're going to roll a rope size about a quarter size plumber's putty and you're gonna we're gonna we're gonna install it around here so when this thing tightens down the excess will ooze out and we'll just peel it off I have parchment paper here um, you can you can just roll it with your hands I just I had some here at the house so I'm just using it so I don't pick up any uh, contaminants or pieces of whatever wood and you get it in here so when you tighten it down you've got something in there so I'm just gonna get this guy rolled out here might need a little bit more the more the better it's all gonna ooze out any excess you just want to make sure you have enough you want to make sure it's solid the whole thing's solid there isn't any it's like, you know, nice and solid quarter inch little rope here. So we go, we put it all on there, kind of smash it in just a little bit. So this piece here is gonna go in here. You wanna make sure this is all cleaned out. There's no debris in here, nice and clean. We're gonna just kind of set that in there make sure it's somewhat centered in there it does have a little bit of play just like that so over on the back side here you're going to place the rubber gasket first over the oh, the uh, threads here then the friction ring. You don't want to throw this away. This is very important because the friction ring allows this piece here, when you go to tighten it up, it doesn't, it doesn't bunch up the rubber and cause any unnecessary issues. So they also give you a tool that goes inside the drain here where you can insert a screwdriver to hold it steady that's this guy right here and then you'll see these little ridges in there and you're gonna hold that steady while you're turning it the other side you don't want to over tighten it but you do want to tighten it now I have a pair of channel locks so I'm just going to just give it one turn you'll probably you just don't want to you don't want to squeeze it too hard because you could crack the PVC but I'm just gonna hold it gently here and just give it one slight turn uh, maybe another one here you can see it oozing out maybe just a little bit more here want to that's good right there we're gonna go with that and once you clean all the excess plumbers putty you can 
install your drain cover at any time. There's a film over it. You just want to make sure you peel all that off when you go to finish it out.